A Randolph County charity is making sure Indiana families get a good night's rest. The volunteers create beds for children who don't have them. As Fox 59's Mike Sullivan shows us, they're about to hit a major milestone. What if there was a blueprint to a smile? How would you make it? Jason Knazinski has an idea. The headboard is the same as a footboard and it's pretty simple design. A couple screws, a few two by fours, and those volunteers. Don't forget them. Since uh, Jim's came on board, he actually builds all the beds for us. They are sweet dreams of Randolph County, a 501c charity creating free beds for children in need in the county ages 3 to 15. Many of them we found were sleeping on the floor. And we found that out through friends and co-workers and people in the community. You'll find Jason's sister, Tanya, folding sheets and tucking comforters. Well, a bed, including the mattress and the bedding, runs about 225 is all. In less than a year of existence, they are on bed 100. We've had over 60 on a waiting list before. Today, they are en route to take Jesse Pettijohn off that list. When we moved, um, we left the beds. With three easily distracted youngsters. <laughs> it's a squirrel. <laughs> sleeping on the couch is tough. It is stressful because when they're sleeping all in just one small area at night, then one wakes up, the other wakes up. A friend told her about the charity. I did think it was because <laughs> I was like, who does that? Nobody just gives away a free bed. A place to call their own. Oh, it is a prized possession. It is something that they treasure. A feeling, a moment that right now is unique to Randolph County. And we get people involved. Maybe this thing can go across the world. Be a tool for a better future. In Randolph County, I'm Mike Sullivan, Fox 59 News. Sweet Dreams is blown away by the donations so far, receiving 15 mattresses in just one day. The organization has some partners now, but every donation helps. So if you want to contribute to their cause, we do have a link. You'll find it right now at fox59.com.